Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and on today's video, I'm going to show you how Microsoft have now implemented a nice, simple way of making anything other than Edge your default browser in Windows 11. Keep watching to find out how. Okay, so in today's video, we can take a look at how to make anything other than Edge your default browser within Windows 11. Now, this is part of the latest update, so you may want to update your Windows version before you attempt this. Uh, if you're on an older version, this may not work, so do bear that in mind. But with all that said, let's get straight over to the computer and see how it works. So this is our Windows desktop, and what you're going to want to do is to click on your start flag, go up to Settings. On the left-hand side, choose Apps. And on the right hand side here, we've got default apps. Clicking on this, you can scroll down through until you find your browser of choice. Ours is gonna be Google Chrome, so we're gonna click on that one. And straight away now, we've got this new entry at the top saying make Google Chrome your default browser, which is awesome. So we're gonna click on that, set default, and you'll see there's a tick box and magically, anything which opens with .htm or HTML, etc will be now with Google Chrome. So this is pretty much most of the job done. Now you're probably noting it isn't just a one click deal. There are still going to be some things which will open as default with Microsoft Edge. So browser wise we're okay, but for some things we're going to want to change it. So we've got options for PDF, SVG files, and no doubt there are some other ones, mail, etc. But we're going to concentrate on the other two that we've got here. So for PDF files, I don't want them to open in Edge. I want them to open also in Chrome. So what we do is click on this one and it comes up with a warning before you switch. Try Microsoft Edge, it's fast, secure and built for Windows 11. Yep, yeah, but it's awful, so we're gonna switch anyway. So it comes up now with a list of other apps you can use for PDF files. Now, of course, you can choose whatever you want. You can choose Adobe Acrobat or Adobe Reader, whatever you wanna do, but I'm gonna choose Google Chrome and then choose Set Default. And there we go. Our icon has now changed and we can do the same here for our SVGs. And we can choose Chrome, set default, and there you go. If there's other apps down here or other programs which aren't already set to Chrome, then of course you can go ahead and choose those as you go. But that essentially is pretty much it. So now any web files will be opening in Google Chrome. So there you go, they've made it a lot more easy. There was a lot of things you had to jump through hoops before and every single one you had to change, it would ask, are you sure you wanna change at least now? You can click at the top one and that will sort out your browser. The others, PDFs, etc., you may want to change manually yourself. So anyway, that's going to wrap up this video. Hopefully it's been helpful. If it has, smash the like button. If you want to see more content like this on a daily basis, then hit that subscribe button and the chime notification and you'll be notified of future video releases. But for now, I've been Mike. This is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To. And hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.